ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣದ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದನಂಬನ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವೈಶ್ಯ ಕಿಂಧು ವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವಿ ತುಸಿದೇಬ್ಬೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನಲುಂಚೈವ ನಲುತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟುದೂಹು ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದಂ ಶಿವ ವಿರಂಜನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹ ಪ್ರಣುತಪಾಲ್ಭವಾಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚಾರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪೂಷ್ವ ದರ್ಶಿ ಗುರುನಾಗರ ಸುಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಶಾರಾಧಿಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾವದಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕವಿತರೋ ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗದಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾವತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ ಬಂಧಿತೋ ದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇಣ ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರಭಿಷೀತ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಯಶ್ಚಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀರ್ ತ್ವಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನ 
नष्टो प्रायशो अभद्रेशो नित्तम भगवत सेवया भगवती उत्तमा स्लोके भक्ति भवती नष्ट की तदा रजस्तम भावा कामो लोभादयस्चजे चेतो एत्वैरना विद्यम सित्तम सत्ते प्रशीदती एवं प्रसन्न मनसो भगवत भक्ति योगता हा सिला गौरी गोष्टीपति गौरी गोष्टीपति श्री चिलो सदा भक्ति सदा सुरस्त जो स्वामी ठाकुर को पर टोल्ड हु व्हाट इज गोरंग व्हाट ऑब्जेक्ट इज गोरंग इन ऑर्डर टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस वी हैव टू जस्ट गिव अप ऑल द असत संग ऑफ अवर लाइफ चिलो प्रभुपाद ऑलवेज यूज्ड टू स्पीक दैट व्हाट ऑब्जेक्ट इज गोरंग in order to understand this subject matter you need to tamam asatsanga ko chhod you need to avoid all kinds of asatsang in this material world who all are near and dear one our mother father brother sisters etc all who if we, they are against hari bhajan then we have to avoid their avoid their sang why all our vitamins and minerals of our body of our atma they will just eat up what are the instructions of mahaprabhu and what is the pathway given by mahaprabhu the the prema the prema pathway given by gorang mahaprabhu whatever whatever the association of of the whole material world we have to uh, deny that we no no compromise will be there even if my father is uh, uh, against me in hari bhajan then we have to then we have to deny the association of our father as well whatever bad habit we have inside our heart or we have some uh, attraction for some enjoyment like sports and everything like it's a habit for me like uh, there is one anya bhilas inside my heart some desire to enjoy that everything we have to give up why because because by this uh, by this there is a, a association with that matter whatever there is vyasang inside our heart any that we want to play and they want to get sports uh, whatever is there everything is a satsang it will i am not a siddh mahapurush that by doing all this that i can remain alive and and can do hari bhajan it is not possible for me it is to speak it's very uh, easy but to do it is very difficult aroho vadi who is aroho vadi Prabhupad, uh, one one time somebody has asked question to Prabhupad that uh, to get rid of our Ohavad is it hundred uh, percent uh, possible? Prabhupad is speaking yes, it is possible hundred percent. But but you need to get Sharanagat onto the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnav. I am always thinking I am very much smart that uh, Guru Dev has. Uh, done something wrong i am i am uh, actually uh, okay uh, gurudev has done something wrong this is called maya bad siddhant vichar on my own uh, personal uh, on my own personal benefit i can stay there but they are actually believing on their own effort that they can do everything on their own will but they will definitely get uh, uh, definitely get uh, definitely get uh, get cheated by maya devi because they believe on their own individual effort that they don't know what they are doing guru vaishnav ka apman kar raha hu to do not to follow the instructions of guru vaishnav 
इट इज़ बेटर दैट आई शुड नॉट कम इन द भजन भजन लाइफ दैट इज़ मोर बेटर फॉर मी बट वॉट आई एम डूइंग नाउ इट्स नॉट गुड टू गेट द टू वी ऑलवेज हैव टू रिस्पेक्ट द पाथवे गिवन बाय गुरु वॉट एवर दे आर सेंग टू अस वी हैव टू डू दैट दैट गुरु देव इज डूइंग रॉन्ग एंड वॉट एवर ही इज डूइंग इज राइट दिस इज कॉल्ड मायावाद विचार देर इज अ वेरी सूक्ष्म विचार रिगार्डिंग दिस वेरी वॉट इज गुरु सेवा एंड वॉट इज लघु सेवा माया सेवा देर आर ओनली टू सेवा इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड whosoever you want to do if you are doing maya seva then you can do maya seva if you want to do guru seva then you can do guru seva it's on you it's your choice you don't have this much of uh, vichar inside your heart that by my behavior i am doing guru bhog uh, you know guru bhogi is a person he is he'll become the most wicked person of this material world he has such a small uh, Uh, idea that uh, he is saying that when when uh, i am doing guru bhog you you come with to me uh, i'll tell you how you have done guru bhog i'll tell you what are the consequences you have to fear you face i will tell you guru vishnu will not get uh, uh, angry with you it's a very important point like somebody wants to play with fire it's like that it is better that uh, if i am playing with fire then it is better but to play with guru vaishnav it is not good at all to play with guru vaishnav is not at all good banne suryo brahmane bhyo te jihan vaishnavo sada banhe aag it's like fire suryo dev surya means sun god brahman with all these three all from all these three guru vishnu were very very much uh, powerful so to play with fire it is uh, prohibited because any time you can catch fire but if you are playing with fire also still it's good but you can't play with guru vishnu it's already written in shastra brahman if you tejyan vishnu sada इट इज इट इज गुरु वैष्णव आर मोर एंड मोर पावरफुल लाइक देन फायर एंड टू गेट बर्न इन द फायर इज मोर गुड बट टू गेट अपराध एंड टू द लोटस फीट ऑफ गुरु वैष्णव देन यू विल गेट देन यू विल गेट पनिशमेंट फॉर इन्फिनिटी लाइफ एंड यू विल नॉट गेट द ऑपरचुनिटी to serve guru vishnu guru vishnu don't eat from anyone they always used to take from uh, they always used to give everything you take you take uh, you take everything for hari bhajan he is not here to take for hari bhajan he always used to give everything for hari bhajan there is one example of nigaraj and shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran it is a very important topic that we have to discuss because uh, normal bonded material per- person he always uh, think that where i have done aparad he don't know a- actually the siddhant vichar because he can't go up till that point he has such a small mind limited mind nigraj has done so much of donation even yamraj maharaj also knows that how much donation he has given in his life and uh, his name is all, also comes in the in the list of yamraj ji maharaj as the most uh, kind of donation given by any person but what happened one time uh, that whatever donation he has given uh, uh, the cows to all the brahmans he has already given the donation of cows to the brahmans and he has uh, given the cows to that brahman and what happened one cow from the house of a brahman he, uh, that cow came to the house of the other brahman and the other brahman he also got one uh, cow from in donation from that same king only but what happened that uh, that brahman he said uh, to the king uh, that uh, this is my this is my cow you have to give it back then that brahman speaking no 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 it's my cow it's not your cow then then they are uh, both of them fighting and they went to the king and said 
that uh, he my cow has just uh, gone into the house of this brahman and this brahman is not giving me my cow back so king speaking that okay if you are speaking i can understand but uh, you are not uh, uh, understanding he is also not understanding so somebody has to understand this point so if you both of them will not understand then th- there there will be a big problem because there will be fighting in between both of them so the king spoke that uh, okay i will give you i'll give you 1000 uh, cows to you but he said that no i only want that cow only i don't want any other cow because of that he became very angry and because of that uh, the raja has to face that karam phal and he become one lizard animal uh, in the uh, dry well of dwarka he was there only for a long time and when all the kids of the yadav vansh they were just playing there when they went there and they said that what kind of animal is like this we have to protect this animal then they want to uh, they want to pick that animal up but that animal was so much powerful that they can't pick that up and uh, when they came to the uh, the uh, when they came to dwarka then uh, they have just given the information regarding what kind of animal they have seen then uh, this is a very unique uh, animal we have seen and uh, we just have uh, made all the efforts to uh, pick him up but he is very much heavy then bhagwan shri krishna is antaryami he knows everything he said that you just show me where it is where that animal is and uh, then bhagwan shri krishna going with all the other one shri kids and uh, just by his uh, lotus feet uh he just uh, take that animal with his lotus feet and then that animal just uh, uh became uh, the they just, he just came with the swarup of a king again and then with folded hands he said still uh, he with krishna knows everything about that then that king is speaking that my name is nagaraj you always you already have heard my name that i have done this kind of mistake that uh, i don't wish to do this kind of mistake but still this mistake is done by me i have to face the karam phal so by uh, just uh, by a lotus feet association i am just getting my uh, getting uh, mukti from this uh, uh, animal body then bhagwan shri krishna standing there uh, uh, in front of all the yadu vanshi kids he is uh, giving instruction to them that even brahma saharan is very much uh, dangerous even if uh, one one uh, rupee if you are taken from guru vaishnav then uh, they will not speak anything you have to you have to get burned in the fire for infinity period whether knowingly or unknowingly if you are do, uh, taking anything from guru vaishnav whether money whether everything you are using uh, anything from guru vaishnav then definitely you have to uh, you have to you have to uh, face the consequences regarding that and uh, his the consciousness level will definitely go down their chetna shakti will drop and uh, they will uh, just uh, 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 they will just disrespect the guru vaishnav and they will get off from the pathway of guru vaishnav here also it is written uh, uh, it is uh, done with me he has already being uh, Uh, by his own desire he was uh, living here he want to, g- to get the anugatya of me and he want to do hari bhajan here i haven't given the permission to live there but still he lived there and uh, while uh, living there before leaving from that goshala he has just taken everything from uh, goshala i know that i do i know that to whom i should uh, to whom i should give punishment i am not going to any policeman also because i know uh, whatever he is doing uh, krishna is seeing everything so whatever he wants to do he do that's why his punishment is that he should take everything whatever he want to like he has taken all the take copper utensils and everything cups and etc from goshala i was just seeing standing there and just seeing that uh, he has just uh, taken everything packed it all the kambal and everything whatever expensive things were there he has taken everything from goshala this is his punishment that this is a big punishment for him because i can't give any punishment i don't have any time to give punishment to anyone i am 
I have to speak Hari Katha and I have to do Acharan of my what my Guru Dev has given me. Whatever a sp- person speaking me that uh, uh, Baba is a cheater, this that, but uh, Bhagwan knows everything. So this is the actual punishment of him. That for infinity time he has to pay for this. So this is the point that every person he just uh, goes uh, with his own will. Bhagwan Shri Krishna has already given one lesson to the Yadu Vanshi that Brahmarishi Haran is very very dangerous. Very knowingly or unknowingly it is very very dangerous. You can see this point. So you can learn from this. Jagannath Das Baba Ji Maharaj also speaking this point that if uh, one uh, one thief is there in this material material person still he can get delivered but if you are if a person who is taking one rupee of Guru Vaishnav then it is equivalent to burning in the fire they will definitely get burned up in the fire they will not get uh, any mangal in their life for infinity period they will not get any mangal in their life they will just get distress they believe that uh, so much of persons have uh, uh, have uh, have uh, so much persons have uh, 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 given lot of persons uh, in uh, back of me they just want to kill me but nothing they can do of me why because guru maharaj is there guru vaishnava are there krishna is there behind me so but the actual point is that every person is going according to his own will he said that he has this much money worth this much manpower what baba can do if you want to take okay you can take no problem so a person if he is just building up his own strength on his money power educational power man power his own material mind power then it is not possible for him uh, to serve Guru Vaishnav and death is uh, they are standing for him like Gajendra like the case of Gajendra you already have heard about Gajendra like in the previous birth also he was Indra Duman Maharaj and uh, by the shrap by the curse of uh, uh, some Muni he was uh, just uh, wandering in the forest in the form of elephant and uh, <coughs> he has so much false ego inside his heart that he is so powerful that he is the king of the forest and he is thinking that he can defeat anyone and uh, all his wives his sons were there in the forest and he is enjoying in the he was enjoying in the uh, in the water there is one crocodile who just uh, have uh, taken uh, his uh, feet with his mouth and he is also huhu gandharva that crocodile is also Huhu Gandharva, who is in the form of Huhu Gandharva. And uh, there was fighting in between both Gajendra and Huhu Gandharva uh, with, with crocodile. And uh, with his own willpower, uh, his willpower just go on decreasing. And he also got uh, what confidence he got on his sons and wife. Uh, it is also get got decreased. And uh, at the end, he because of the... Uh, in his previous life he what mantra he has got from his Gurudev he just remembered that and then he just remembered uh, Supreme Lord Shri Hari Krishna he just uh, remembered the previous uh, birth uh, mantra what he received from his Gurudev and then he just remember uh, Lord Shri Hari and uh, Krishna just thought that he is uh, just calling me and then uh, Krishna coming in the form of Hari and just uh, uh, I am just uh, in shortcut I am explaining then he uh, uh, saved Gajendra so the person who is like a mad elephant uh, going like a mad elephant like Gajendra by his own educational power money power uh, false ego he actually wants to protect himself. It is just like uh, 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 it is just like that standing for him. If uh, when his when in his heart he will understand the glorification of Guru Vaishnav inside his heart, then only he can understand that uh, Arohavad inside his heart it will get uh, converted into Avarohavad. He will get that surrender feeling onto lotus feet of Guru Vaishnav and Bhagwan. 
दिस इज नॉट द पाथ वे ऑफ शरणागति वॉट ऑन विच पाथ वे यू आर गोइंग दिस इज नॉट द पाथ वे ऑफ शरणागति दिस इज कॉल्ड दैथ वे ऑफ गुरु है गुरु भोग वेन एवर देयर इज गुरु सेवा देयर इज वैल्यू देयर इज लाइफ वेन यू हैव लेफ्ट योर सेवा यू आर जस्ट लाइक अ वॉकिंग डेड मैन Prabhupada also speaking that whenever he is doing seva, he has value. When he has anya vilas and he has all kind of desires inside his heart, then it is like a dead man who is just walking. He has no value at all. He is like a dead man who is just walking without life. Guru Vaishnav is giving seva. Oh, you just do seva, just do seva. You are not doing the seva of your father. You are doing the seva of Prabhupada. If you are thinking that I am doing this, I am doing that, so what you are doing? You are doing your you are doing Guru Vishnu Seva. No, if you don't want to do, no, don't do. Don't have this false ego inside your mind, inside your heart. If you want to love Prabhu, love Guru Vishnu, then you have to do Seva. Otherwise, don't need no need to do. Guru Vishnu are not that much weak that uh, if somebody can uh, leave them, they will just get into distress and they will become nervous. then if they become nervous it then he is not guru guru is that if you want to stay you can stay otherwise you can go to to understand uh, guru as laghu is a big abrad so don't uh, uh, understand like that if you want to stay and want to say guru seva you can you can do uh, the person who is doing oiling is not guru dev to understand uh, guru as laghu that is a big aparad so i just want to save them but still they want to die what to do we can't do anything in that so avarohabad to get uh, avarohamad means to get sharnagar onto lotus feet of guru vishnu and to get that absolute truth when uh, my when i when i can't see guru vishnu because guru vishnu has so much power that guru vishnu don't speak uh, any foul language to anyone not even because guru vishnu has so much uh, if you have so much prema on to the lotus feet of guru vishnu then why you are running away from guru <coughs> that when i am coming uh, when uh, guru vishnu were going uh, uh, in front of you for 7 uh, 10 days then you have some other work to do then uh, this is not the thing we are such a foolish person we don't have this much vichar that if i can stay in front of maharaj then i can uh, then i can uh, uh, learn a lot of thing but still uh, uh, you can't understand that if i can stay in front of maharaj then i can get a lot of uh, things regarding bhajan from maharaj but still you have some anya uh, anya vilas you are going for that what i can do because you don't have this much uh, of vicharas because you are thinking that i am very intelligent but still uh, maharaj has come here for 5 to 7 days if i can uh, just kick all the anya vilas on one side and can do uh, guru seva then uh, because i am not going to uh, uh, going there to eat i am actually giving uh, something to you okay whatever you think you think what i can do who who so ever are going on aroho pantha guru dev always don't give any upadesh any kind of upadesh to that person how much uh, how much prema you have for uh, guru vishnu it is all uh, dependent upon your acharan whatever you are sitting eating sleeping drinking everything it depends on that so this is the actual swabhav of the bad jiva they always think that i have done this i have done this why should i why should i do that they always have this kind of vichar inside their heart if there is no profit that why should i do that that previously when i have spoken this point then uh, if i have some interest then only i will do guru De- guru seva if i don't have any interest why should i uh, do guru seva i am giving any uh, uh, gurudev not giving me anything any property this that then why why should i do guru seva what i will get by doing guru seva so this is the actual vichar what i have inside my mind to do guru seva and uh, to uh, to make a life of our self interest <coughs> if that pathway is open then only i can do guru seva 
if i can get something from uh, guru se guru dev then only i will do guru dev uh, guru seva oh maharaj ji dandavat i will do this sir all kind of drama i will do in front of guru dev if i have myself interest is uh, uh, is uh, completely satisfied बाय प्रकृति ओनली हमारा शरीर आवर बॉडी प्रकृति का है आवर बॉडी इज मेड ऑफ प्रकृति हमारा सूक्ष्म शरीर आवर सब्टल एंड सब्टल एंड फाइन बॉडी ऑल इज गोइंग ऑन बाय द हेल्प ऑफ प्रकृति ओनली वी कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड दैट आई एम दिस सब्टल बॉडी और आई एम दिस फाइन बॉडी और वेदर आई एम दिस आत्मा इट इज़ वेरी ईजी टू स्पीक बट टू गेट रियलाइजेशन अबाउट दिस पॉइंट इट्स वेरी वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू गेट एस्टेब्लिश इन सिद्धांत विचार वॉट एवर द द रिलेशनशिप विद द सप्टल बॉडी एंड द रिलेशनशिप रिगार्डिंग द सप्टल बॉडी लाइक आर फादर मदर एटसेट्रा ऑल वी आर थिंकिंग दैट दिस इज आवर ओनली दैट विद प्रकृति प्रकृति इज फाइटिंग आत्मा इज नॉट टेकिंग पार्ट इन दिस द ओनली पॉइंट इज दैट आत्मा इन द आत्मा इज देयर इन साइड दैट फाइन फॉर्म प्रकृति एंड पुरुष बाय द एसोसिएशन ऑफ प्रकृति एंड पुरुष आत्मा इज गोइंग ऑन यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड दिस पॉइंट और नॉट पुरुष मीन्स जीवात्मा जीवात्मा इज देयर विद जीवात्मा देर इज एन अदर पुरुष देर आर टू पुरुष इन साइड अवर बॉडी वन इज जीवात्मा करता हम इति मन दे मीन्स दैट वॉट ही इज डूइंग अहम एंड सेकेंड पुरुष इज द परमात्मा ही he is actual the actual purush because his uh, purush akar his uh, uh, that bhagwan can only speak that bhagwan can only speak that i have done this so inside our inside uh, jeevatma there are two purush there is another purush is paramatma who has taken infinity world inside in his in his hand and the individual jeev atma that purush sharir ka andar mein baitha hua hai he pure de they always think that i have done this this false ego is called uh, that of a jeev atma pure means that that jeev atma who is sitting in that uh, temple that in that body नब्बद्वार मीन्स देर आर नाइन गेट्स इन द बॉडी दैट जीवात्मा इज जस्ट सिटिंग इन द टेम्पल ऑफ दैट नाइन गेट्स एंड दैट परमात्मा इज ऑल्सो सिटिंग इन दैट 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 परमात्मा इज देयर इन साइड दैट टेम्पल ऑफ नाइन गेट्स दैट्स वाई दैट टेम्पल ऑफ नाइन गेट्स इज मूविंग like a piece of iron when put in fire it has become molten like orange color like orange but iron don't have the property to get fire up but when the iron piece is just put it in fire then that property of fire is just uh, get transferred in the iron piece and you can and you can see that uh, the iron same iron piece can uh, 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 that uh, can transfer that fire into anyone else also because he got, just got that property from the fire so similarly paramatma is there with jeevatma inside our temple uh, inside our uh, uh, body that's why it looks that uh, our body is uh, in chetan vastu our body is moving and if the atma is gone and the parmatma is gone then our uh, body is just uh, prakriti its nature its dead so prabhupad speaking this shlok vimuratma karta aham iti manna ye mere ko karta aisa samajh ke baitha hua ahankar so they always think that uh, i am doing everything he has this false ego but he don't know that uh, because of uh, me inside uh, heart present it's because of me everything is going on so he always think that by this uh, uh, by taking this pathway my mangal will be there so this is called arohavad 
all those abu asuras they are abu devadi they always think that on this pathway we will get a uh, lot of pratishtha and we will get uh, uh, all the happiness they don't know the actual meaning of the happiness but all these asuras they are unvaivadi they can understand that they we ha- you have to follow us that i am doing everything they have this false ego and moksha vadi are there gyani yogi are there they just want to go up and up they have this false ego that they are whatever they are doing they are doing perfect they just want to they just want to get on the singhasan of brahma by just kicking that brahm vastu uh, mahaprabhu speaking this what mahaprabhu told that that all the gyanis they always wanted to become brahm and they always have this desire that they will become brahm when they will go up they will just uh, be sitting on the throne of brahm you see i am brahm the, this this kind of conception is there inside the heart of a gyani so they always think like that and they are just going towards the pathway of nark of hell our sharnagati should be uh, vastavik sharnagati our sharnagati is not actual sharnagati why we are not improving in our spiritual life what is the reason about that because we don't have that sharnagati on to lotus feet of guru vishnu and bhagwan by just having a symptom uh, by just having a shadow of sharnagati we are thinking that we are following guru vishnu because in the heart of sharnagat bhakt he can understand the bhava uh, of uh, guru vishnu Uh, that what kind of seva they have to do prabhupad also speaking this point that uh, all the all the talkings all the vani of uh, vaikunth jagat and golok vani is <coughs> should be should be heard from the lotus mouth of the guru vishnu otherwise uh, the clouds of uh, agyan and all the false ego will not get destroyed without that by just listening to the hari katha from the right source from the actual mouth of the lotus mouth of guru vishnu so in this way we can get the information regarding the vaikunth jagat and this uh, with this devi dham in this material world like this kuntha ve jagat there is lot of hesitation everywhere i can uh, remove this hesitation and can go to that aprakrit vaikunth jagat but by just hearing this hari katha we can understand that all calm growth lobo all this which are will get removed then only we can kya uh, ho sakta what can happen then that person can go slowly and steadily under the uh, guidance of the sadguru lotus feet <coughs> by taking his association he should have this which are inside his heart that's why uh, big big pandit also big big acharya also what is the actual uh, what is actual shot panta what is the importance of the lotus feet of guru vishnu and uh, what our guru bhak has told they just all uh, going on their own pathway and just by just kicking the pathway of the guru vishnu that's why they are all fun tranade bhi suni chen is a must in our life if it's a very it's a very distant point but still if they are not uh, uh, if they are not respecting guru vishnu then uh, there will be a pathway of hell open for them already for infinity period so they have to follow the pathway of the shrot panta what our guru vishnu uh, have uh, shown us guru vishnu ka samne rehne se to stay in front of guru vishnu slowly and steadily beta you see what you are doing you are following mayavad which are you are doing this is not good at all you have this is not the pathway of bhakti you have to do in this way if you will stay in front of guru vishnu beta this is not good you have to do this what this is all mayavad which are you are following why you are going on this pathway you are not going on the pathway of bhakti that uh, nobody no friend will uh, teach us 
only guru vishnu will actual guru vishnu will tell us that you are going on a wrong pathway you just have to go on the pathway of bhakti what our what is our shortcomings all will be shown by guru vishnu only if nobody will show our uh, show our shortcoming then how we will go on that pathway of bhakti if we are thinking that uh, uh, guru vishnu was just speaking all rubbish then uh, be, because guru vishnu was not crying at all if you want to take whatever you want to take from guru vishnu you can take but this is only your loss only maha prabhu ji ne upadesh maha prabhu has already told about uh, this in his in instructions in shiksha ashtakam that this is this is not a dry philosophy but this has just become a dry philosophy in our life but it is actual not dry philosophy because this kind of instructions are not there inside our heart like i i have just put one feet on a i have just put one feet on a one uh, particle of a uh, one particle but uh, then uh, when i put that feet on the one on the particle then i have to see that where that particle is so tranadapi suniche in that shloka i should be more humbler than the blade of the grass if you cut that bla- blade of the grass also if it is going up if that uh, some uh, cow or some uh, cattle can come and uh, eating it you should become so much smaller than even if a cow also comes to it they can't even get to eat that uh, blade of grass nobody want to think about this the uh, this uh, uh, this uh, treasure of aprakrit jagat nobody wants to take it it is all drama drama going on in fr- uh, just by taking guru vishnu in front they are just want to they just want to make their material enjoyment uh, happen they just want to do guru bhog if they have uh, uh, the desire to follow guru vishnu then they can uh, understand that how to uh, follow guru vishnu so i will uh, just touch the shloka uh, what i have previously spoken because if i will not speak about that shloka because there is so in depth analysis of of a bhajan that uh, how much hairs are there on our head we can't uh, even uh, we can't uh, uh, number that we can't count that so in this way it's very important to have the in depth uh, analysis of all the shloka uh, spoken by shri uh, rupa goswami pad in upadesh amrit if i will speak about this vichar then you can't even know what how that what is the condition of all of the bhakt what is actually krishna bhakti what are guru vishnu and what are the characteristics of guru vishnu we can't understand this and our whole hairs on our head it will go we will go bald because there are uh, uh, there is no person who want to understand this shri upadesh amrit if there is rare one person then it is by the kripa of guru bhagwan that uh, we can get that one person but that person also will not come uh, in uh, in counting she love you not talk about talk about always already speaking about this point that uh, i have also seen very close about the bonded jeev maharaj we will do this we will do that but i am just laughing and seeing that you see what he is doing let let him speak by within 7 10 days oh maharaj how i can do uh, it's very difficult to do this seva i am just uh, by uh, i am not speaking anything i am just cheating them because if i will uh, because I, if i will uh, be uh, using i uh, finding faults in them and just uh, with strict mood i will be going against them then they will not understand that like uh, like uh, i have already told previously that this which are is not good no uh, he is become angry well, why it's not good so if he is becoming angry okay he is becoming angry what i can do but but if when his luck is good then he can understand that oh 
उत्साहमय घन तरला व्यूड विकल्प विषय संग्रह ऑल दीज विचार एक्चुअली इट शुड बी वॉट वॉट आर दीज इन डेप्थ इंस्ट्रक्शन इन द वे ऑफ भक्ति वॉट डू यू मीन बाय ब्रह्मचारी एक्चुअली इफ यू डो इफ यू आर नॉट गेटिंग मैरिड इट डजेंट मीन दैट यू आर ब्रह्मचारी बिकॉज इफ यू आर नॉट गेटिंग मैरिड दैन द एनिमल्स इन दो जू आर मोर बेटर देन यू बिकॉज दे हैवेंट गेट मैरिड सो बाय यू जस्ट कम टू मी एंड जस्ट डू सेवा देन एक्चुअल ब्रह्मचारी यू कैन मेनटेन ब्रह्मचारी इज नॉट दैट यू आर नॉट डूइंग एनी मैरी मैरिज इफ यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू डू मैरिज इफ इट इज ब्रह्मचारी देन ऑल दोज एनिमल्स इन द जू दे आर मोर बेटर ब्रह्मचारी देन यू एट लीस्ट दे आर नॉट सींग द फीमेल काउंटर पार्ट देर इज अ डिफरेंट लॉइन इज इन द डिफरेंट जोन I don't have any. When uh, in the phase of breeding, they just used to put them in one place. But it is not possible that I will also make my Anya Vilas as uh, Anya Vilas as uh, should be successful, and at the same time I will do Guru Seva as well. It is not possible at all. Both the things are not possible at the same time. That is not possible. You have to do it in a clear cut way. Guru Vishnu are not afraid of anything. They know everything that what is there inside the heart of everyone. Prabhupada has given one uh, example regarding this. There is one of the writings. There is one. Uh, there is uh, one lake in which there is one frog who was living there. and he has so much of uh, false ego that he thinks that uh, he uh, nobody is above him that frog is thinking that nobody is above him that frog then uh, uh, he just find one coin he find one coin from somewhere and he just uh, sat on the coin and uh, just uh, thinking that as if he is uh, just a king and uh, nobody is uh, as uh, rich than me i am the most uh, profound person of this uh, whole uh, pond whether the where the whether the elephant of the king came i will just uh, <coughs> arrest him and i will just kick him but i am the king of this pond nobody can uh, take it from me he was just just found one coin and was just sitting on that coin and he was just uh, speaking like that <coughs> he was thinking himself as he is he is the king we have already seen uh, with our naked eyes all was he just uh, for, they just forgot they just forgot that what they are that uh, previously when they remember oh i don't have anything to eat my father was an accountant He used to go eight to ten kilometers barefoot and just to come back, uh, just to take two chapatis when when uh, uh, father will come and take the uh, uh, chapati. Now they have crores and crores of sampati and they just want to kick uh, Guru Vishnu. They are saying just who is Guru Vishnu? I am everything. I have already seen it with my naked eyes. Everything. They have their fallen condition. I have seen. <coughs> but uh, the people of this world they don't think about this point at all they just they just want to understand us eating sleeping stool and urine they don't understand about bhajan at all if someone can understand anything about me please let me know that they have only attention on uh, uh, this material world only only the acharan of guru vishnu of the sadhant vichar of uh, guru varg they have to catch that but they can't catch that because those who have kripa of guru vishnu they can't speak about wrong siddhant vichar like vaman goswami maharaj even one siddhant also you can't uh, uh, find any error any fault in that from their uh, childhood till uh, uh, when they have they have, when vaman goswami left his body he hasn't uh, have any fault in the siddhant vichar 
सो आई एम नॉट हेयर टू नॉट हेयर टू टेक एनी वन ड्यूटी ऑन माई हेड वॉट एवर करम फल दे हैव दे हैव टू जस्ट गेट पास दैट ऑन देयर ओन आई एम नॉट रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर दैट सो दिस फ्रॉग वन जस्ट सिटिंग ऑन द कॉइन विद हिस चेस्ट अप विद हिस चेस्ट ब्लोन अप विद फॉल्स ही गो ही इज जस्ट सिटिंग ऑन दैट कॉइन एंड ही वॉज स्पीकिंग दैट द किंग एलिफेंट ऑफ दैट किंग कम एंड नो एंड आई विल नॉट अलाउ हिम टू कम इन द पॉइंट He is taking uh, water and this that. Today nothing will happen. And the uh, elephant of the king came. And uh, then after he just jump after the of the coin and he just said to elephant, "Hey, don't go." And the elephant not seeing anything. Uh, where is the frog? And uh, that uh, frog just got uh, get into the legs of the in the into the legs of that elephant and he just got crushed. so prabhupad is speaking and this is our condition that uh, we are just a small person we have some uh, very so small small efficiency of some money and have done some seva for my guru seva but it doesn't mean that uh, we will uh, do bhog of guru maharaj that guru maharaj will become my servant hey, guru dev is not my servant he is such a foolish number 1 he is number 1 mayavadi Do you have to go according to Guru Dev, or Guru Dev will go according to you? First, you have to decide this. You are just a big Maya body. You have to carefully think of this point. Then only you can go go ahead in your bhajan. Prabhupada speaking that uh, we have taken birth in this uh, world. That karam veer, that dharam veer, all having that big big title with them, who just want pratishta only in their life. they want to become karam veer they want to become dharma veer they want that their uh, name their title they should get in their life and they want to just write the name on the chest of this whole world so so some want to become a big advisor as well but they want to become a big donator as well but they don't have this much of idea that uh, what is that it is not possible to do anything for from me he has everything is done by prakriti in his bonded soul in his bonded avastha in a shuddh condition in a pure condition uh, everything uh, what is done by uh, guru vaishnav is uh, is free from uh, bondage but but this uh, world always think that i am very much intelligent i am full of vichar so i can do anything on my own so i can't explain the full shlok i'll just be touching this shlok you have to understand these all shlokas because by not understanding these shlokas you can't understand upadesh amre that all everything will become waste just try to understand this with full attention abhadra means that there is an earth inside our heart that uh, all kind of uh, anartha which are present inside my heart abhadra means all kind of anarts are present inside my heart the nerves are always going to get rid of us but if i will make such a condition so that i can get rid of all this anarth then only the nerve can go outside our body outside our outside our conception in bhagavad gita mahapurans also it is written that in which whose life all the nerves are going to get rid of from whose life all the nerves are going to get rid of all the false ego going to get rid of almost they are getting rid of if they if they do the service of granth bhagavat and uh, bhakt bhagavat seva then definitely they will get uh, uttam that they will get bhakti under the lotus feet of uttam shloka bhagwan 
दे विल डेवलप नेस्ट की भक्ति दे विल हैव स्टेबिलिटी इन देयर भक्ति देयर भक्ति इज नॉट गोइंग हाई दर एंड थाई दर वे देर इज अ स्टेज ऑफ भक्ति सम वन नो बडी हैज दिस मच पेशेंस टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस पॉइंट इफ दे हैव दिस मच ऑफ माइंड देन दे कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट ओ हो महाराज आवर भक्ति इज नॉट एट आवर स्टार्टिंग स्टेज ऑल्सो those who have falls ego inside their heart they cannot understand this point whether they are at the ajare position or they are doing a rupanu ka bhajan raganu ka bhajan they can't even understand this point because they have already thrown shri rup ko swami pa ji ko swami pa vishnu chakravarti all they have thrown off and they just want that their uh, name should be uh, preached all over the world false name दे आर स्पीकिंग ओ महाराज एन अर्थ इज देयर नो वरीज वी कैन जस्ट टू वी कैन डू रागनू का भजन इन दैट स्टेज ऑल्सो शुड आई टेल यू वॉट द चारे इज स्पीकिंग कैन आई कैन आई जस्ट शो यू वॉट द चारे इज स्पीकिंग एंड वॉट प्रभुपाद इज स्पीकिंग एंड वॉट केशव गोस्वामी महाराज स्पीकिंग वॉट श्रीधर महाराज इज स्पीकिंग वॉट वामन गोस्वामी महाराज स्पीकिंग इट इज ऑलरेडी रिटर्न देयर बट स्टिल दैट अचारे इज नॉट अंडरस्टैंडिंग जस्ट डोंट वॉन्ट टू बिकम सो मच क्लेवर एंड स्मार्ट लाइक अ क्रो If you want to collect stool and urine, uh, just you just collect. Uh, in uh, when this uh, whoever is doing uh, Granth Bhagwan and Bhagwan Bhagwan Seva, if he is not doing uh, Seva of Granth Bhagwan and Bhagwan Bhagwan, then uh, he will not get realization at all because realization will not come without Bhagwan Bhagwan Seva. so almost when all the anarthas are going to get rid of from his life if he is doing uh, granth bhagavat and bhakt bhagavat seva continuously then he will get that stable uttama nashtik bhakti bhagavati is seventh ke seventh is the seventh ke sending bhagavati that in the uttam shlok bhagwan under the under the lotus feet of uh, भगवान नेष्ट की भक्ति विल इनकर लाइक नेष्ट की भक्ति मीन निष्ठा निष्ठा मीन स्टेबिलिटी विल बी देयर इन योर भक्ति इट्स द क्वेश्चन दैट दिस काइंड ऑफ आचार्य जस्ट वांट टू जस्ट टू प्लक आउट योर निष्ठा एंड थ्रो ऑन आउट बट स्टिल दैट कान बी प्लग एट दैट पॉइंट व्हाट हैपन जस्ट वॉन्ट टू बी बी अटेंड बी अटेंटिव अबाउट दिस पॉइंट एट दैट पॉइंट वॉट हैपन जस्ट डोट नीड अटेंशन ऑन दिस पॉइंट एट दैट मोमेंट वॉट विल हैपन ऑल दो रजो गुण एंड तमो गुण भाव इन साइड योर हार्ट and whatever uh, kama krodh lobho mad matsar jo all these six enemies inside your heart present all these anarthas anarthas slowly and steadily they will uh, they will get out of the they will get out of your uh, fine body from your material mind and heart and they will understand that uh, 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 there is no point uh, sitting in his heart now जस्ट बी अटेंशन पे अटेंशन टू दिस पॉइंट ऑल दिस सिक्स काइंड ऑफ एनिम इज इन साइड योर हार्ट एंड योर मटीरियल माइंड दे विल नॉट मेक एनी अट्रैक्शन टू योर मटीरियल माइंड टू योर माइंड नाउ एंड योर हार्ट विल बिकम एज क्लियर एज अ क्रिस्टल and uh, it will not affect your mind and your heart hamara chetna ka jo our uh, consciousness will not uh, be attracted towards all this and it will uh, remain in a steady state and will remain un- untouched with all those anathas lekin but cheto eto in anabiddham bola dhyan de baat par but here it is written cheto eto in anabiddham मतलब 
बट इफ देर इज स्लाइटली सम रजोगुण रजोन तम तमोगुण भाव इज देयर स्लाइट भाव रजोन तमोगुण भाव बट देयर रिएक्शन विल नॉट बी सीन इन हिम so by this our so our heart will uh, not be having some kind of reaction but we can uh, we can speak like this that uh, they haven't said that uh, it has gone completely from our heart they must have said that it is completely erased from our heart they said that mayavadi log all and all those sahajyas they always think what they are doing fault at what point they don't know because they are not in the line of the shrot pantha they are not in shrot pantha they are always becoming angry on this point ha uh, what you are saying ha huh? we are not in guru in the line of our guru varga so when uh, if they are in the line then what param guru dev when guru dev was told but you are not following that it means you are not in not in गुरु परंपरा सो एवरी पॉइंट वी हैव टू बी केयरफुल एंड पुट अटेंशन ऑन आर ईच एंड एवरी वर्ड बाय द बाय मोर सत्तोगुण इन साइड अवर हार्ट and uh, all this calm growth they will be having very least reaction on our heart they that uh, person can't find any reaction of the surajoguna tamad but still there is some reaction like one poisonous snake is there if uh, we have if we have taken out the poisonous teeth of the of that snake from his mouth and then when i will be do, enjoying and playing with that snake then nothing will happen because all that poisonous reaction from his mouth is just being uh, pulled out so but for example if one ayurvedic medicine is there if there it is uh, if it's there in your hand then if a snake is there then he will not cut you i have already seen this point uh, uh, i have already you know, practically in my life when there is one snake coming uh, uh, just uh, in front of one person but he has some ayurvedic medicine in his hand but the, there is uh, one small piece of ayurvedic medicine inside his in, uh, on his hand but snake is not going to bite him so in this case so this is uh, at the entry of the bhagavad bhakti but what you are speaking about rupanuga raganuga it is very much extensive portion we can't go up till that point that is a preliminary step so this is a preliminary step in the way of our hari bhajan and where there is where there is hari bhajan and uh, raganuga bhajan this is just uh, foolishness to think like that rajastama bhav so all the srajo and tamo bhagwan and kamro lomo but still must be there but they don't have any reaction inside our heart mera hidar bhi koi disturb nahi karna hai lekin it is not disturbing our heart but still it is there anartha rashi but when all this anartha anartha rashi all these six kind of enemies will uh, get completely and uh, then there is uh, their uh, combination of sat satogun rajogun tamogun inside our body up till then it is just like a dream hari bhajan is just like a dream we can't do hari bhajan like this if we get rid of all this rajogun tamogun satogun and in the samne sindhu rupa ko sampa already written that when when your bhavana inside your heart your bhava thinking power when your thinking power hamara thinking power ko when your thinking power at what point we can extend the our thinking power to bhavana par to bhavana chinta bhavana means when you are continuously thinking about some point how at what point of uh, you can extend to the your extreme limit then also from the extreme limit you to extend that further then then excellent anand 
and there is a a door open for an excellent anand but we can't understand what that anand is what kind of anand is and it is beyond our explanation what kind of enjoyment it is we can't understand that point so that door just get opened up excellent anand door of excellent anand just get opened which is beyond our uh, material mind Our heart, our heart become full of satogun, and uh, this satogun actually is not uh, the satogun of this uh, material world, but this satogun, no, this is actually shudh satu. Shudh satu means pure satogun. But when shudh satogun is established inside our heart, is established inside our heart. then everywhere there is light and light of uh, shuddh satguna then what will happen bhati to bhati to bhavana vato ja chamatkar bharavu hidi satya jal baram bright baram then there will be brightness there inside our heart just for that is called rath that is called the actual ras which we we can taste at that time at that point of time you can uh, whatever you are tasting that ras that is called ras and whatever material ras you are busy with and ju- in just by enjoying it it's nothing because this jad ras will take material ras will take you to hell definitely you can't get uh, get rid of this ras in the starting also i have already spoken this about this point that if you want that uh, you want to follow the instructions of uh, gorang mahaprabhu and you want to just uh, make uh, uh, just want to follow the pathway of uh, prem uh, pathway of gorang mahaprabhu and you will get krishna bhakti as mahaprabhu has spoken about mahaprabhu already told about this point that uh, that without without prema if i have crores and crores of rupees still i have crores and crores of property still it doesn't matter for me but i am the most uh, poor person of this world because i don't have krishna prema inside my heart and i want to become the servant of the servant of uh, the guru vishnuv this is the actual request of mahaprabhu and this is also the request of <laughs> request of me also and uh, else is the uh, else is the will of krishna and uh, next week i will just preach about one point first i will preach in front of me myself and then i will preach in front of you that without by doing uh, preaching in self in front of myself i will not i will not preach in front of others this point i will understand i uh, will discuss in next week and narottam das thakur also speaking in gaudiya vaishnav gan and all the gaudiya vaishnav gan tamam gaudiya vaishnav samaj bhagat they are always uh, they are always uh, thinking that they are just uh, uh, the dust particle of the lotus feet of the shila roop goswami path nobody they are in our gaudiya samaj whosoever they are in our uh, gaudiya samaj is actually Uh, is actually connected with the shila roop ko swami pad and they want to give their uh, identity in uh, relation with shila roop ko swami pad and uh, they just feel uh, topmost anand when they feel that they have some uh, they have uh, when they give their identity as shri roopanuga they feel proud about this point that they are they are we are going to meet they feel very proud about this point but sacha rupa goswami pad ko follow karne but actually who just want to follow shila roop goswami pad that is the main point to which we will see like bhakti vinod thakur narottam das thakur have in their kirtan has written about this with realization krishna das kaviraj goswami everybody identify themselves in relation to जैसे हमारा नॉर्थ उम्र 
like narottam das thakur is there they are solid written in their kirtan एक्चुअली Rupa Nuk, they just want to become dust particle of lotus feet of Shila Rupa Swami. You have already heard, na, in the introductory speech of Shri Samrit. Yesterday we already under the guidance of Guru Vishnu. This is the Adesha instruction of Purapad has already told that if in the heart of someone, if the instructions of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Adarsh, Acharan, everything is getting established. And he is get he just want to get Anushilan in the instructions of Gorang Mahaprabhu. Then we should definitely we have to follow the Shad Goswami, six Goswamis, especially the seventh Goswami. Who, without following Shad, six Goswamis, <coughs> without following six Goswamis, we can't even get. We can't get the summary of the instructions of uh, the perfect information regarding the instructions of Gorang Mahaprabhu. Especially the seventh Goswami who is Bhakti Vinod Thakur. We just want to, I just want to speak more about that. When, if the Siksha of Bhakti Vinod Thakur is not uh, there inside our heart, then we can't digest the actual instructions of Gorang Mahaprabhu and Srila Rupa Goswami Pada inside our heart. It is very difficult. The principal Goswami of all the six Goswami is Rishila Rupa Goswami Pad. And whatever Rupa Goswami Pad has written this Upadesh Amrita Rasamrita Sindhu, we have to follow this and we have to uh, understand what Bhakti is actually is and how to follow the Gaurang Mahaprabhu actually. Even up till now, Sanatan Goswami Pad also speaking that he is also Rupa Nuga. He is also speaking, Sanatan Goswami also speaking that he is Rupanuk. So you can understand what kind of uh, point this Rupanuk bhajan is. So up till what point you can go? So the Siksha, Siksha and the instructions of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, when we, before getting that, we have to know the Upadesh Amrit, uh, instructions of Upadesh Amrit given by Srila Rupa Goswami Pad and the uh, Upadesh Amrit of Srila Prabhupada and uh, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Subha Bhakti Vinod Vani Mahabar, we have to understand each and everything about that. All these. And uh, Raghunath Das Goswami is Shriman Siksha. And in when we will go ahead in our bhajan, then we will find the instructions of the detailed instructions of Sri Gorang Mahaprabhu and the mystery of our bhajan, the bhajan rahasya. But with our own false ego, we can't get inside this uh, kingdom of uh, prema. By our false ego, we can we can't we can't enter into that spiritual life can't get uh, entry in this transcendental world that is quite impossible somebody has just uh, learned all the shastras and he's, uh, he is it doesn't mean that he's a big vaishnav somebody can uh, speak about the shastra and the vedan sutra it doesn't mean that he is a big vaishnav first we have to understand that whether he is not speaking his own siddhant which are or else he is speaking uh, just by following our guru work it is just not a matter of fighting. First we have to find this point that whether they are following our Guru work or not, whether he is there established in Shrotpanta or not. If he is not established in Shrotpanta, then we have to uh, kick him. So under the guidance of Sadguru Ashray, Sadguru and in the field of Shuddha Bhakti. 
अंडर द गाइडेंस ऑफ शिला रूप गोस्वामी पास ऑफ देश अमृत डिस्कस द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ द गौरंग महाप्रभु शिक्षा अष्टकम देन वी विल डेफिनेटली गेट द रियलाइजेशन ऑफ द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ गौरंग महाप्रभु प्रीवियसली वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द उपदेश अमृत और शिल रूप गोस्वामी पाथ फर्स्ट उपदेश इज दैट वी हैव टू गेट रिड ऑफ द शर्ड वेग ऑल द सिक्स एनिमीज प्रेजेंट इन अवर हार्ट भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर ऑल्सो डूइंग दैट कीर्तन भक्तुनो ठाकुर डूइंग दिस कीर्तन I have done a lot of uh, hard work so that I can get rid of all these six enemies, but I am failure actually. I am unsuccessful. But I have also told about Pralad Maharaj that how Pralad Maharaj was crying. And uh, next week I will discuss uh, about this point of Pralad Maharaj as well. This is such a unique point. How Pralad Maharaj is speaking in front of Narsi Madhav that I am just fed up of all this. Deva Huti Ma Mother speaking to Kapil, uh, God Kapil, Bhagwan Kapil Ji that I am just fed up of all these uh, material sense organs. I am just making so much effort so that uh, I can get uh, control over all these uh, six uh, enemies, so that uh, all these greediness should go away from my heart. But still, I am totally failure. And uh, now you are only the shelter. You are only my shelter now, Krishna. Nobody else is there in this whole material world. Devahuti Ma is also speaking about this point too. Nitaram means continuously. That my all my material sense organs, it's just like a fire. They don't want to get rid of that fire. and they are asking more and more and more and more each and every fraction of second they these sense organs are not speaking that yeah, that my sense organs they are always it's just like uh, putting ghee putting ghee in the fire if someone in the starting fire is uh, putting some ghee then the uh, fire will in, in, in uh, will increase more and more so that's why we are just under tamo uh, gun uh, just please save me oh prabhu there is no other way and pralad mar also speaking all this shloka i will just discuss next week very very beautiful shlokas what pralad mar are speaking and uh, about pururava as well pururava is just enjoying urvashi and uh, my question is that pururava has uh, done enjoyment with purvashi or urvashi has has done enjoyment with pururava who is correct that pururava has done uh, enjo- enjoyment uh, of urvashi or urvashi has done enjoyment uh, with pururava what is the actual uh, answer bharat muni has already written in the kam shastra about this that there both of both of the ras of pururava and uh, uh, urvashi is equal there is not but mostly both the ras are the same so it is very important to understand this point pururava at the end has explained that hamara wo devjani ka patni that uh, my wife wo bhi bata di agle hafta ye sab charcha karenge i will just speak about this next week bale kuch nahi hone wala that uh, he said that uh, nothing will happen if you will bhuyo eva bhi bhuyo eva bhi 
भूयो एवा भी वर्त थे मीन्स दैट दिस ऑफ अग्नि दिस फायर विल नॉट गेट एक्सटिंग सो इन द वे ऑफ अर साधन पथ इन द पाथ वे ऑफ अर साधन द फर्स्ट पॉइंट इज दैट हु सो वॉट एवर साधन यू आर डूइंग अंडर गाइडेंस ऑफ ज्ञान योगी कर्म योगी भक्ति योग एनी काइंड ऑफ योग द फर्स्ट स्टेप इज टू गेट कंट्रोल ओवर ऑफ मटीरियल सेंस ऑर्गन्स you just have to get control over our material organs i'll give just one example regarding this because there are lot of shastras um, i have given given it to you if i can relate everything one example then you can understand very easily what is that uh, thing especially the persons of bengal they know uh, about yogi moklath baba our that that is not that lok nath go swami he is a vaishna he is a parshal of mahaprabhu but uh, who he has taken birth at diamond harbor kochuberia in the sagar sangam i have uh, went only once and uh, there is a big uh, story behind that oh maharaj how i can't explain that i have just went there once time and i don't want to go any uh, another time just by the just by the kripa of all the vaishnavas i went there by the Uh, help of one port trust officer there that's uh, ganga sagar liya port trust they have Aan just taken one uh, steamer and uh, two to four vaishnavas they have given me one cabin and this is one experience from bag bazar ghat from launch i just came to the diamond harbor and this experience i will not uh, you know i will not uh, this kind of experience i can't forget even by leaving this body also what kind of experience how i can get oh my god i can't explain that if i just remember that point it's just like all sweating comes in from my body there is one uh, there is one uh, location there that is called kochu beria and where there that loknath baba that yogi was uh, has taken birth sare aadmi uska aarti utarta hai all no and everybody used to worship that uh, yogi whatever they want to do okay they can do what i can do i can't do anything but that yogi there is one story i will just speak in two words so that you can get an idea so that you can get an idea what i want to speak he and uh, one of his friend they were just uh, studying in the school and when they just grew up they just uh, went to himalaya and they just taken one uh, shelter of one uh, yogi guru they have just taken one shelter of the yogi guru and he is not a foolish person he has uh, taught everything about how to do yoga but uh, all this yog shiksha given by that guru loknath baba friend jo dost hai he is getting that intact way and he is getting rapid improvement in his yog bhajan iska unnati is getting rapid improvement in his yog bhajan but loknath baba is not getting uh, improvement in his uh, yogi bhajan he is not getting improvement then yog that yogi guru uh, he uh, just uh, seen his consciousness in a consciousness he said that you just go back home because so you will not get the uh, yogic bhajan perfectly why because you have some interaction some attraction is there there is some attraction inside your heart there you have some uh, love with some girl you go there you just see his condition her condition and just came back you just see her condition and then you just come back then all your uh, this uh, nasha all this uh, will go away when he went back to his village he said just see the condition of the of that girl then after seeing the condition of that girl he said that oh this is life then he came back to the uh, himalayas to his yogi guru and after that and after that getting training from that yogi guru then uh, he said that your at that attraction has gone away 
नाउ यू कैन डू नाउ आई विल सी वॉट यू कैन डू देन इट इज देन इट इज वेरी वेरी सरप्राइजिंग टू सी दैट हीज इम्प्रूवमेंट वॉज सो रैपिड सो रैपिड दैट द फ्रेंड हु वॉज डूइंग that he was you know lognath baba has already stayed in the village for one year but he was doing uh, yog siddhi for one year but it is easy for him to go more advanced in the yogic bhajan but when he went from his village he has just so rapid improvement so rapid improvement that he just uh, went off from his friend also he just go up in the yog bhajan and then he become siddh then his name was become loknath baba he is a he is a yogi he don't have anything uh, with our bhakti yog but this story just i have given you an example so that you can understand one day what happened police one pol- police persons have just uh, taken him to the custody because baba was doing bhajan under a tree and thoda uh, duri par he was at a very distant place and some murder was uh, done and they just uh, taken the baba in the custody police custody <coughs> you come with us you just have to tell us what happened there then the opponent uh, lawyer just told that he is just a old man he is more than 125 years how can but how a person of 125 years so what is the condition of our eyes how he can see the murder spot the from this far distant place it is just a uh, he is just uh, speaking like then he is uh, speaking all uh, all uh, all foul words to baba that uh, all foul words to baba that you are speaking lie you uh, how can you speak lie then baba speaking that i am not uh, speaking lie i have already seen what that this person has actually murdered that person but they are not understanding then baba speaking okay you do one thing in front of that lawyer baba speaking jo kamra hai that this room where this uh, whole progression is going on outside there is one tree and there there is a tree of uh, mango yes there is a ma- tree tree of mango yes so you just go there and see that all the ants from there slowly steadily they are going up oh the lord is being oh you are speaking all rubbish then baba is speaking you go you go and just check you just check and the just speaking that is a that is surprisingly that all the red ants are going slowly and steadily from down to up so the lawyer speaking that if someone can speak is uh, so i'm speaking that if someone can see from that distant area that all those red ants are going from uh, down to up then uh, it is possible that he uh, that he can see from a far distant place about the murder that who has murdered this person okay <coughs> so this way everything is get established there hairan karne wala this is a very surprising case there so if we will not understand this upadesh amrit then all our bhajan life is useless if we are not uh, uh, understanding upadesh amrit under the guidance of guru vaishnav then our uh, uh, bhajan life is destroyed it's zero nothing is there shila rup ko swami pad in his first shlok has already given us that we have to control the the shad shad vek the six enemies these are the biggest enemies in our uh, in the in the life of sadak these are where these are all the six uh, shad veks are very very important to get captured they are thinking that our enemy is outside prabhupa speaking this point that we are but in actual our enemies are inside only ripu ripu means that uh, enemies ripu means enemies ripu means the enemies are there inside our heart prabhupad always speaking this point that uh, nobody uh, nobody want amangal of anyone 
इफ दिस करम फल इज बैड देन नो वन कैन डू एनी थिंग इफ वी आर सिटिंग एंड वी आर डूइंग हरी भजन देन दे कान डू अमंगल ऑफ अस बिकॉज इफ आई एम डूइंग भजन इफ आई एम डूइंग भजन someone is there beside me also if we have that fall of confidence that uh, guru dev and prabhupad is there if if that confidence is just broken that asta just got broken then uh, nothing can be done so this uh, confidence should be there because uh, some kind of distress we will feel that oh what to do so that vipralam bhav should be there but we have uh, at our back our all our guru work so shada roop shada roop shada roop shada veg we have to control we have to get victory over them this is the first as advice of shila roop goswami pad sharvik sharvik daman sharvik daman and if we will speak that uh, by controlling of all the shada veg will get automatically and we will discuss ras lila this is so i am not in the way of my guru parampara i am not following the pathway of shrot pantha i am just a fallen soul this it will prove because rup goswami was speaking this prabhupad speaking this point to pehle kadam pehla so the first step of the in the first shloka pehla rup goswami pad is uh, telling us that you have to get control over our six enemies you just need to make sure that you have to get control over all these six enemies because the goswami has all the controlling on these six enemies and uh, just have control over all their material sense organs and their material mind and heart they have their control and then they they used to use they used to do mangal of the whole world and then uh, do their own mangal as well and in the third shlok also how to get rid of these uh, six enemies what is uh, beneficial for our hari bhajan for krishna bhakti in the fourth shloka how to do, give a portion to give nourishment to the bhajan to our bhakti where we where our bhakti can get nourishment and get maturity it is about this in the fifth shloka it is written about the madhyam about the madhyam adhikari vaishnav it is written and what is the duty of the madhyam adhikari in the sixth shlok and with the with material eyes with material thinking we are thinking that uh, about uh, a prakrit guru vaishnav we are just uh, comparing their co- co- transcendental qualities of guru vaishnav with the uh, uh, prakrit drishti with the <coughs> material eyes with material in the seventh shlok how to do how to uh, do hari naam how to do krishna naam in the eighth shlok how to do rag anug bhajan like the braj braj prem braj prem how to get that ninth shlok is how to do bhajan uh, which is the topmost bhajan uh, kriya it is uh, already i am discussing in bhagavad bhagavat amrit uttram i always speaking to already speaking to uh, parikshit maharaj what are the appropriate positions and status of a bhakt uh, what is the bhav according to that only he will uh, just uh, uh, make improvement in his bhajan and in the ninth shlok bhajan ka jo sthan hai what is the actual place of the bhajan the topmost bhajan is radha kund topmost place and the tenth shlok is who is the topmost bhajan kari what is the ashram vishra vigraha for that bhajan that uh, the importance of radha kund they have told us so like this uh, rup goswami pad has told us bhakti vinod thakur ji ne bhakti vinod thakur all always had given a, a small uh, commentary on this shila rup goswami pad of shila rup goswami shuri upadesh amrit saraswati thakur ji ne saraswati goswami thakur ko pad already speaking this point the summary of the upadesh amrit shri upadesh prakashika tika uh, all this anuvritti has given by shila prabhupad in the form of a granth shakrdo upadesh amrito ka bhasha saho ek likha hai and he has given 
how to attain Bhagavad Dharma and how we can how it is the actual summary of uh, the Upadesha Amrit written by Shri Rupa Goswami Pad Bhakti Mata Thakur and Prabhupada already has given us uh, in the uh, it is already been published in Sajjan Tochani and in the Gaudiya but now Prabhupada speaking here that it is a uh, this is a vishay of distress that this is full of distress that uh, that all those Prakrit Sahajiyas Ravindana Thakur also all, always uh, asking Prabhupada that what is uh, what is Prakrit Sahajiya Sahajiya I can understand but what is Prakrit Sahajiya then Prabhupada speaking to Ravindana Thakur he is uh, telling him that those who are uh, the what is the actual general dharma of uh, that uh, transcendental world to render some service for Krishna to seek his hundred percent satisfaction Bhagavan ka Sarvangin Santushti to seek hundred percent satisfaction of Krishna those persons are called a Prakrit Sahajya so that they can satisfy Govind at their fullest that is the natural uh, uh, chesta. This is called Sahajya. Prakrit Sahajya means material Sahajya. They don't want to understand the Aprakrit transcendental Vishay of that transcendental world. And if they understand that, but they sh- they always want to make sure that they want to get uh, La Puja Pratishta and they will uh, get uh, La Puja Pratishta by uh, putting uh, themselves as a Raganuga Rupanuk Bhajan. They are doing that. So, in tri- great distress, they are Prakrit Sahajya and Aprakrit Sahajya. This is the difference. Ravindranath Thakur speaking that I have, I haven't, <coughs> I haven't heard about this point in my whole world, my whole life. So, all this Prakrit Sahajyas in our Sampradaya, they always think that they are doing the Rupa Nugatya. Of Shila Rupa Goswami Path. They are just taking the name of Shila Rupa Goswami Path and they are what they are doing all rubbish in the name of Shila Rupa Goswami Path. And uh, they are taking the name of Shila Sanatan Goswami Path, Shila Rupa Goswami, Shila Jeev Goswami Path, etc. All the Shad Goswamis they are taking their name and uh, they are just making a different, different kind of uh, commentary, their known Siddhanta which are they are making. And they are just uh, destroying the whole uh, whole world. The Rupa Nugatya is a very far distant place. <coughs> but they are just taking the name of Jeeva Goswami, Rupa and Sanatan Goswami. They are just making one story. <coughs> and after hearing that story, everyone will become surprised. That with that uh, efforts, they are uh, just Ye making money Ye and they are just collecting stool and urine. And they are doing a prajan to the lotus feet of the Shad Goswamis as well. Some days before, maybe eight months uh, before, uh, from Nandgao, one person, like uh, up till Ter Kadam, their Baba Log all, all used to know me. There is one Baba there in Terkadam. He just uh, cry and just uh, calling me through one devotee at night time. He just called me up. And uh, I just want to hear that what they, what he want to speak. Then uh, he told that, that there is one Baba in Barsana. I don't want to speak the name of that person. He has uh, taken a lot of La Puja Pratishta. Because he is so clever that he has taken a lot of name. That Baba has taken darshan of Radharani. All the monkeys are very much uh, uh, attracted towards that Baba. But uh, he is actually the master of some uh, of Assam. Who has just called me from Teri Kadam, from Nandagao. He is just crying and uh, speaking to me. That uh, he said that uh, in his Harikatha, 
that Roop Goswami has just got married and he has his own sons and everything and he is just speaking all rubbish. Then I told that okay he just want to speak let him speak. I am just indifferent from that point I just don't want to speak about this point. But the point of distress is that they are speaking that uh, Jeev Goswami Pad uh, not uh, getting the Anugatya of Jeev Roop Goswami Pad and Sanatan Goswami Pad. If uh, why then uh, if he has done Anugatya of Roop Goswami why he has got uh, why he has established the Swakiya Bhav? I have given a lot of answers in uh, Hindi and English Katha as well about on this point. So these uh, persons are just uh, fighting over these issues. <coughs> Sanatana and Rupa Goswami have established Pariga Bhav and Jeev Goswami Bhav has established Swakya Bhav. Even a Baba, one he is actually called Bade Baba Barsana. He in also Sabha also he is getting that these Gaudiya Wale, these, all these Gaudiya Mat people, they, they, their interpretation about Gaudiya Mat is different. They are always speaking Parikya, 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 Parikya. What is Parikya? He is such a foolish person. You can't even imagine. They are so much foolish. And lakhs and lakhs of people are going just for him. So let them go to hell what I can do. Up to what point I can speak like a dog? Because there is a, some point of Siddhanta which are, I can just, uh, speak, how, for, for how long I can speak this Siddhanta like a dog? Okay, let them go. I am just uh, giving my 100% effort. That's what I can do. So they are just uh, thinking uh, and they are just doing uh, Aparad onto Lotus Feet of Shad Goswami. And Bhaktivinoda Thakur in his uh, previous Ashram also, he should not go to his previous Ashram. This is not good. Bhaktivinoda Bhakti Thakur stays in his previous ashram where Bhakti Thakur is, there is Vrindavan. They have just taken Bhakti Thakur to Ram Bhagan. Bhakti Thakur wants to go to Ram Bhagan? No. He is actually doing a swastri love. If somebody has taken him to Ram Bhagan, it's not that Bhakti Thakur uh, he's, has gone to his Purva ashram. No. This I want to discuss this point, this foolish point. Is there any humanity inside my heart? Bhajan is a very far distant uh, thing. Whether humanity is there inside my heart or not, just first I have to check. Then how I can speak this point? That Bhakti Mnod Thakur has gone to his Purna Purvashram. Then I should also go to the Purvashram. There is one big Baba of, uh, of Radha Kunda. I just want, don't want to... I don't want to speak his name. He is a Sahajiya Baba. He has just given... Uh, he has just uh, given uh, his uh, marriage to daughter and has just went to his poor washram. And where it is written that he can went to his poor washram. But he is foolish number one. He is like an owl. All thinking that, oh, this is right actually. This is right actually. If he is gone to his puna, okay, no problem. He can go. Okay, let us, uh, if it is going on, then it should go. What to do? Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada He is Sajjan Toshani He is writing that he is, he is Rupanugatya Has given a lot of uh, things of regarding Rupanugatya I have already spoken about this point That uh, under the guidance of Srila Rupa Goswami Pad uh, Srila Bhakti Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada At the banks of Sri Radha Kund In Kunji Vihari Mat He was uh, and at uh, the uh, and, uh, in front of Prajmandal Parikara party. He was just giving the explanation about Shila Rupa Goswami Pad of Desh Amrit. And uh, Prabhupada has just uh, uh, <coughs> has just uh, that uh, Rupa Nugatya Bhava in his eyes and just crying under the name of Rupa Goswami Pad and just discussing Shri Rupa Desh Amrit. And this Upadesh uh, Amrit uh, Vichardhara of Srila Rupa Goswami Pad, uh, <coughs> Prabhupada has uh, taught us the topmost Rupa Nugatya. And uh, the Rupa Nugatya, uh, Rupa Nugatya, and Prabhupada always used to speak, Oh, don't go there, don't go there, come here, come here and hear Harikatha. 
आई नो दैट इफ यू विल कम हेयर यू विल फेल यू विल फील डिस्ट्रेस अनहैप्पी बट वैन यू विल गो देयर यू विल जस्ट गो टू हेल्प बट दे जस्ट वॉन्ट टू हेयर दरी कथा ऑफ सहजिया बाबा Uh, Prabhupada also speaking and crying, and that you want to come here. You are you are feeling very unhappy and distressed. But what to do? This is the actual medicine. You have to take this medicine so that you can get rid of this material bondage. If I will not speak, then uh, I will uh, face the punishment. If I will uh, hide all these points in front of you, then I will get the punishment. Why you are doing the? Why you are doing the work of a guru? The why you have uh, hid hide the absolute truth. That punishment will come on me. So this is my duty that I have to give this uh, to you. Whether you have to take or not, it is on you. I will not uh, be angry to you because it is of no use. So in this way, Prabhupad was speaking and like roaring. Oh, the all sahajiyas, don't go there. Don't go there. You will get lost in this material world and go to hell. And the sahajiya speaking that why you are speaking that I am sahajiya. Why you are speaking that? You are Sahaji actually. He is speaking to Prabhupada. Yes, yes. You, I am all. I am all. I am Sahaji. But we are actually Aprakrit Sahaji. The because the actual dharma of the Aprakrit Jagat that is there inside our heart given by Krishna. So we are Aprakrit Sahaji. The actual birth prem uh, given to us by uh, Shri of Shri Krishna, which is quite natural. That is there inside our heart, so we are following that. So you are following, uh, you are Prakrit Sahaji. Yes, we are also Sahaji, but we are a Prakrit Sahaji. We are a Prakrit Sahaji, and you are Prakrit Sahaji. By this, uh, Prabhupad has given the difference between the two. And if someone wants to take this vichar, then it's okay. If don't want, then we can't do anything. Because if every person will go towards that aparakrit, because if there is a one shop of diamond, uh, you can't expect that a uh, lot of persons can come like the case of the confectionery shop, where you will get rice, you will get dal, you will get khaskas. You give us this, you give us that. You give me masala, you give me sweet, you give me sugar. So you will not uh, find in that case. But in the shop of a diamond, that in the whole day, maybe rare one person will come, or sometimes no one will come. In a car shop also, one car uh, cost range about twenty lakhs, thirty lakhs. So, uh, there, is there any line like a confectionery shop there in the car shop? So, in the same way, the the aparakrit tattva vastu actually. Uh, nobody wants to hear about that it is very rare who will uh, just hear to who will just uh, hear about this who want to who who will who will do atma samarpan to lotus feet of guru vishnu because everyone wants that they just want to get their personal rights they just wants to make their uh, make sure that personal desires are fulfilled but they said they are always thinking okay baba should stay here like this they have their personal desire inside their heart i am just crying and you will uh, just uh, feel distress in your life that's it shila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami dagar prabhupad ji ne shila prabhupad always used to speak this point saraswati goswami dagar prabhupad ji ne has uh, told us about the rupa anugatya but they have told us uh, a lot of things about rupa anugatya i will just speak about this in the next week as well because if i will speak today then it will uh, remain incomplete so i will uh, speak under the rupa anugatya what is rupa anugatya in actual that uh, prabhupad what is the feeling of prabhupad what is the realization uh, that prabhupad has regarding uh, what <coughs> is rupa anugat i will just discuss it uh, in the next uh, hari katha and i will stop my uh, i will just uh, stop today prayesh avadreshu nityam bhagavato sevaya bhagavati uttama shloke bhakti bhavati nishtiki तदारजस्तमो भाव कामो लोभादयस्तजी चेतो एतोनाद
सिद्धम सत्य प्रसिद्ध थी एवं प्रसन्न मनसो भगवत भक्ति योगता भगवत भगवत तत्व विज्ञानम मुक्त संगत सुपरियाय थे मुक्त संगत सजाय थे वांछा कल्पना तो उसके पास इन्द्र भविष्य पतितारं पावन भविष्य व्योनम